my name is Riley Miller. I am a spicy food enthusiast trying to learn how to cook. I decided to combine the two in a project that I'm calling the Cantharos of Scoville. Cantharos is an ancient Greek drinking vessel. The ancient Greeks worshipped many gods, and the most fun-loving of these was Dionysus, the Greek god of wine and debauchery. Dionysus would throw big parties at which everyone would drink wine, served using a cantharos. Spicy cuisine has a lot of parallels to alcoholic cuisine. Both were originally developed as a means of safeguarding against bacterial growth in a world without refrigerators. They both may be seen as unpleasant to the palate and an acquired taste. They both cause some damage to the human body and are accepted beyond that because of the pleasure they offer. The contrasting aspects of aversion and attraction are woven together into flavors to create challenging but sublime meals. When indulged in to a significant extent, they may produce a sort of euphoria intertwined with suffering. To be a spice lover is to evoke the bounty of Dionysus, as may be poured from a cantharos. My cantharos is named after Wilbur Scoville, a pharmacist who developed the most well-known means of measuring heat levels in spicy food, the Scoville Scale. Measured in Scoville heat units, SHU, his method was to extract the capsaicin from chili peppers and then fit it to taste testers inside cups of sugar water and see what concentration of sugar water it took to remove the spice entirely. This is somewhat subjective, as tasters may have different sensitivities, but further chemical analysis has shown that Scoville was onto something in his measure of capsaicin. To make things interesting, my explorations into cooking will more or less follow the Scoville scale, from the lowest Scoville units to the highest that I can manage. I'll start with making something from sweet bell pepper, and try spicier and spicier cuisine, using different peppers and hot sauces, until my body just can't handle it anymore. We'll see where that line is. For each cooking video, I'll talk about the process of making the food. As long as the recipes are freely available, I'll show people how I do it. I'll discuss my impressions of the spice level and how I care for the meal. For the hot sauce videos, I'll talk about the spice, the flavor, and how the sauce is marketed. A lot of these sauces are marketed in ways really flamboyantly and funny, while some of them are just rude. I'll discuss the overall experience that they sell. Well, that about sums it up. Let's get cooking and drink the Gantharos of Scoville.